Hey guys, it's Taz here. Yes, another vid already. Uh, this time about the patch 3.1.6. Uh, this is actually the um, highlights from um, the <coughs> YouTube vid that uh, Dislight actually did. Uh, let's watch these guys and see what they have to say. Hello, Spurs. I'm Tom. Hey guys, I'm Nathan. Oh yeah, I remember. I remember this one. The, the guy on the left it does look like he's actually being held at gun gunpoint. In this version, we will have two new experts joining us. Thanks to your votes during the divine support, the first one is of course our Fathom sisters, composed of Udania, Vanessa, and Sandrine, and they are also part of the Destiny's Pit. The second is the long-awaited. Yeah, I really do want him. He does actually look amazing. I don't know why he's a support rather than a fighter. I wonder where the gun is. Probably behind the Dreams of Far bit. But I think people need to realise that uh, English isn't his native language and these aren't actually actors. These are actually probably the developers of the game. So that's why both of them aren't, you know, as vocal or vociferous as uh, some of the actors out there could be. She is a bit better than he is, that's for sure, in terms of um, how she comes across. Oh, she seems to have a personality, whereas he doesn't. But uh, but you've got to give them credit. English isn't their native language for either of them. Yet uh, both of them are enunciating, pronouncing things very well indeed. Yeah, that's a bit I dislike. The fact that that particular uh, skin is only available for a short time. And it should be free to play for everyone. And obviously, so today, she yeah, was going to be made available again. So that was basically the 3.16 update. So where they basically talked about the uh, where they're moving the game to and everything. One of the things I do dislike about the uh, developers is they never tell us when they actually nerf heroes. And uh, they did say... In one of the previous updates, after they did the Lee Ling update, they were actually going to ensure that uh, they will let us all know they're actually uh, of any major decisions they make in the game. And nerfing Gaius or Zeus is unbelievable. You know, they just, they, they're, they're basically just proving once and again they don't care about free to play players at all. Um, it's such a shame. It's such a shame they're actually doing something like this. You know, for free to plays, when you get Zeus strike Gaius, it's the biggest thing you can possibly think of in this game. It's like in some of the other games that I play, like Castle Clash, it's like basically getting one of the dragons, um, getting one of the most OP heroes in the game, and you want to throw everything you can at that particular hero, and they decide to uh, nerf them. See, here we go. Points Championship. That's point wars, basically. So that's going to be very much pay to win um i hope that's not going to be the case and this looks a little bit like um brewster's thing okay thanks guys for watching i'm going to leave it as that uh, not too happy about the uh gaius uh zeus nerf um, I hope it doesn't take place, but uh, who knows with these guys. Anyway, thanks for watching, and see you again next time. Bye.